What's going on everybody, this is the Game Hunter channel with another episode of Star Wars Commander Rebels and today we're gonna give it a shot to one of the new mercenaries, the Lugabist Munitioner, right? I was trying to make a video of this new mercenary with my Empire account Unfortunately, I got really busy upgrading to Headquarter 10, <laughs> so it was impossible to do it. But we're gonna give it a shot to this new unit with the Rebels, okay? Really interesting, really, really interesting. Boosting damage, huh? I'm wondering how cool is the... Luga Beast surrounded with uh, probably some heavy soldiers. Yeah, that would be cool. All right, guys, so let's go to a couple attacks. You guys are ready? Let's roll. All right, let's go attack number one. Interesting base. Hmm, upgrading to headquarter level 10. Dreadeca Sentinel. Uh, I don't see oppressor, but uh, well, let's see what we can do. First of all, we're going to try to see if there's anybody in the squad center. Probably not. Okay, that's good. So we're going to deploy our units in this area perfect Luga Beast in the back goodbye Dredeka thank you for joining us that was a really nice uh, party <laughs> all right let's use Luke probably with a medic draw in the back I'm gonna start pushing forward with the Luga Beast look at this guy okay just wanna, I would love to see the exactly the percentage of uh, bonus and damage that we're doing with that unit right that would be really cool. But, uh, okay. At least I want to see that unit in action. I'm pretty sure if he's behind the sharpshooter, that sounds like a really good deal. Wow. I just started thinking that that's a really good combo. Having sharpshooters with the Luga Beast behind, increasing the damage and everything. Hmm. Okay. Call me crazy, but that sounds amazing. Uh, let's see what we can do. Still 29%. We're not doing really well. Uh, there is a lot of uh, rapid fire turrets, and this base is a high level base compared with my troops. But we're still gonna give it a shot and keep attacking. That's never gonna stop us. And you get that. Yeah, the Lugabis is. Wow. We got Lugabis and Medic Droid with those sharpshooters. That definitely is a definitely deadly combo. Wow, I like that. I like that. In the meantime, my heavy soldiers are suffering in this area, destroying walls, because, well, there is nothing else to destroy. Let's destroy some walls. That, that would be cool. And let's see if we can put the droid deck in here, so we can get some extra damage, because we got 43%. Oop, hopefully the deck is going to survive. Yeah, still alive. Perfect. Can we get a 50%, guys? That would be cool. There you go. At least we got one star. Again, this base that is going to uh, headquarter level 10, so it's quite remarkable. And I really like what the Luga Beast is doing. Hmm. Again, mixing the Luga Beast with the sharpshooters seems to be the way to go, the Rebels. Interesting. All right, that was our first attack. Not too bad. Two stars, decent loot, and Luga Beast was doing a really good job uh, boosting our sharpshooters. You guys ready? Let's go for another attack. All right, let's go against this base, another headquarter level. Is this a new one? I think it looks like a headquarter 10, no? <laughs> Give me the idea at least. Um, let's give it a shot. We're gonna go with this combination that I just decide to try. Oh, this is not gonna end well. Let, let's take a look. Let's see what we can do in here. This is definitely gonna be tricky. But with sharp sharpshooters, are, okay, sharpshooters are taking care of pieces. Good. Okay. <laughs> First stage complete. I was kind of a concern. I just realized that I got all these sharpshooters with the Lugavis. Uh, and uh, so far it's doing alright. I'm not gonna put more. Uh, droids close to the repair droids close to Luke because there is a bunch of rapid fire turrets and I'm, of course all those little droids are gonna go down in a few seconds but in the meantime look in the back I got my sharpshooters destroying every single wall <laughs> every single wall they are getting influenced by the look at this and also wow look at all, how shiny is that <laughs> how shiny is this look at that <laughs> it looks like a super saiyan right I got my sharpshooters doing a really good job. Medic droids in the back. Look at this behind. Uh, they're pretty much. How, how are you supposed to kill those guys? How are you supposed to kill those guys? They do extra damage. They get in repair. They got the look at this in the back. That is just ridiculous. Look at this. Well, if, if you guys decide to start attacking buildings, that would be awesome. Okay. Really, really awesome. But uh, in the meantime, they're doing a definitely good job. Come on, guys. Start aiming for the turrets. That would be great. Okay, perfect. 
otherwise my medic droids are gonna go down. Which is ah uh, that mortar is gonna gonna cause some trouble. Let me see if we can destroy it. Otherwise these guys are definitely gonna go down. Can I destroy that mortar, please? Oh, thank you. Okay, finally, 35%. Can we get 50%? That would be sweet. It's, it's been taking so long. They, 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 they spend so much time destroying the, every kind of a wall that I, I don't know if we're going to be able to get the 50%. Probably not. Probably that's not going to happen. That was a missive or failure. Come on, it was so close. 49%. Guys. Gee, really? <laughs> Super Saiyan? Super Saiyan sharpshooters? Look at this guy. Look at <laughs> look at the aura that is coming from there. Getting repair on the look of this. Wow. That's really You know what? We're going to try one more time. Let's try one more time. All right, let's give it a shot to this one with the oppressor in there. That's going to be a challenge. Uh, for that reason, we're going to probably use Leia. All right, we're going to deploy Leia first. With that little repair droid. Um... Sharpshooters, right behind. Do your beast. And let's see what happens. Oppressor is going to cause some trouble in there. I'm, I'm really hoping that Leia is going to be capable to do something. There is another, there is one of those sunny cannon in there, which is trouble. But, uh, oh yeah, okay. Went down. That's good. That's good. Leia, you stay alive? Alright. Stay alive and let's destroy that uh, sunny cannon. Ooh, that sunny and it's gonna kill some. Oh, okay. Ooh, so lucky. All right, sharpshooters. Now you guys need to do your job. Stop attacking walls unless destroy the base. Okay, that's what happened in the previous attack. Oh, come on, these guys don't learn, man. All right. In the meantime, let me put the droid deck in here and see if we can get more percentage of damage. Because uh, unfortunately, we have some wall killers in this episode. <laughs> but the look at this is working really well with the sharpshooters. Again, if the sharpshooters decide to start attacking the base. I'm sure we'll be doing a really good job. Uh, we're getting close to 32%. Not too bad. I think, we can, I think we can do it. There is a chance. We'll see. We'll see in a few more seconds. I hope you guys are really excited because episode 7 is almost here. I'm pretty sure you guys are ready. I'm ready. I I had to cancel the premiere. I was going to go and, and watch the movie on the release. And I, for personal reason, I decided to cancel. But uh, I'm going to be going in a few so uh, i'm not gonna share anything during my episode don't worry i'm not gonna spoil anybody's experience with the movie at least for a few days okay and after the after probably two weeks after or one week after the release of the game of the movie i'm sorry we're gonna start talking about force awakens okay all right look at this is doing okay uh, again my sharpshooters are getting stuck right there in front of that wall which i found extremely ridiculous but somehow we still were capable. Okay, at least we were capable to get two stars against this decent base with an oppressor. Not too bad. Not too bad. We keep moving forward. This is a conflict, and I believe we're in the Obsidian League by now. Huh. Nice. Yeah, yesterday, well, the other day I finished the in Danduin in the 1.5% in the Chrome. Hmm. Yeah, not too bad. And I and I like those uh, special events because they motivate you to like a play against something special. In this case, it was a, I believe it was an uh, upgrade for the shock trooper. Not too bad. All right, let's go for the last attack in this episode. All right, let's go. Plenty of loot, which is what I need. I need to. I'm almost ready to start moving to the next next headquarter, which is actually great. Headquarter nine. So I'm um, looking for loot. So let's get this party rolling. Uh, I'm gonna start probably the point some one. Over there, another soldado rebel there. Uh, we can probably start attacking directly from the front. Yeah, I don't see why not. Okay, let's go. Hopefully, there's not any traps in the middle. Let's just hope. Okay, what is look? Oh, look, I'm gonna get deployed. No, thank you. Thank you. Let's go with more. This is a more standard army for the rebel players. I got some fire droids in there, which, but we're gonna wait for a few seconds. Let's get a little bit closer first. Where my Lugavis? Lugavis, right there. Thank you so much. And then we're gonna deploy some fire droids, which are gonna be super useful as long as long as we destroy the shield generator. Otherwise, it's gonna be a good joke. <laughs> Everybody's aiming at Luke, which is great. Luke is receiving tons of damage, but uh, uh, I need to bring down one of the shield generators. They're not going down. They're not going down. Come on, guys. Come on, just do, do your part. Look at this, it's right there, pushing everybody, but I, I, I don't see anything moving. 
those mortars are just deadly right now against my uh, my heavy soldier. Oh, hellfires are going down. Yes, hellfires are down. That's not good. Uh, all my heavies decide to go in another direction. It's probably not something I was suspecting. I was suspecting these guys to get close. Got my Lugavis in the. Oh, really? Where are you going, man? Where are you going? Really? You gonna you gonna boost Juan? That's what you're gonna do? Okay, what a waste. <laughs> <laughs> what a waste. In the meantime, my heavy soldiers are going to be capable to destroy this base without any issue. Probably give me two stars easily. But I just can't believe the Lugavis decide to go with home. Oh, dude! Really? Really? But it's still, look at that. The aura is still influencing Juan. El Soldado Rebelde. Sweet. Okay, well, interesting. I can't believe the Lugavis went to support the soldier instead of going with the rest of the troops. But uh, I guess it's because they were closer. I think I think Juan was close that day. The other, the other units. All right, not too bad. Look at this, quite entertaining. Yeah, I, I need to come up with some strategy for that that new unit. Um, I don't know. Probably. Wow, well, I, I can see that with the Empire, it's gonna be super powerful, right? If you boost the damage with the heavy cannons and the ATAT with the Lugavis in the back. Oh boy! <laughs> All right, fellas. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Star Wars Commander Rebels. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share my videos. Take care, everybody.